Louisiana baseball made final preparations here at the Teague before they will face Texas in the College Station Regional. And for the hour long practice on Tuesday, you could really see how locked in this team is. Now, one of the many things that's gotten them to this point is the Cajuns ability to respond out of their 58 games that they've played this season. They have only dropped back to back contests just five times and that responsive mentality has prepared them for the postseason. When you're playing other big teams, sometimes that jersey can be intimidating and make sure you look those guys in the eyes and not their jerseys because they're human just like us. So when you step on that same field as them, uh, no, no jersey, no logo is going to intimidate us because it's man on man and you're playing against us. So. I'm ready for it. You know, I've seen, we've seen videos throughout the years just of the game. You watch it back a little bit and watch how man that goes the other way around. John's ball, he's a part, you know. That guy don't catch a dive and play. I mean, you watch it back, so we're ready. But you know, sometimes you, I think you need a little bit of that, a little bit of controversy, you know. There's nothing to it. You know, you just got to work hard and show up and get ready to play again, you know. And we, we look forward to playing good when we get over there. The Longhorns are familiar foes to the Cajuns. In last season's Coral Gables Regional, Texas and UL met with UT coming out on top. But the Longhorns still hold a great amount of respect for Louisiana. You know, Louisiana's a good team. Played them last year. We got a good, good club, so going to work this week, focus on them, and then take care of business when we get there. Uh, you know, it's going to be a bunch of crazy Aggies. Uh, you know, the Cajuns are going to travel well, and, and it's just going to be a very exciting regional. The Cajuns regional opener against Texas is on Friday at 5 p.m., and the game will air on ESPNU. Covering the Cajuns, Jamarcus Fitzpatrick, KETC Sports.